Five things I didn't know until I reached Endgame in Elden Ring Part 3. In Tombsward Catacombs, you can find Lutul the Headless, an extremely strong spirit summon that teleports and deals lots of damage along with the instant death status effect. In Lake of Aeonia, the Meteorite Staff and Rock Sling Incantation can be found extremely early into the game, making it a staple to builds that revolve around spells and magic. In the back of Dragon Barrow Cave, you can find the Bullgoat Talisman, a talisman that increases poise by a massive 33%. In Fort Gale, you can find the Star Scourge Heirloom, an extremely useful early talisman that provides a plus 5 strength buff. If you are looking for early game strength and dexterity buffs to mix with your wondrous physic, a strength crystal tier can be found northeast of Stormhill Shack and a dexterity tier can be found northwest of the Scenic Isle. This will provide you with a massive plus 10 strength and plus 10 dexterity buff that lasts 3 minutes when used. 